Welcome everyone to the Dr. Nguyen YouTube channel. Today's topic is one that many are curious about but few dare to discuss openly. We're delving into the realm of natural penile enlargement. It's a subject shrouded in myth and misconception, yet it carries significant importance for many men. Our intention is to shed light on this issue, debunk the myths, and provide scientifically backed natural methods to help you navigate this sensitive topic. So without further ado, Let's delve into the natural ways to increase the size of your penis. Scene script. First and foremost, a balanced diet plays a significant role in penile health. A well-rounded diet is essential for more than just keeping your waistline in check. It's a pivotal part of maintaining penile health and boosting its potential. Our bodies are complex systems that rely on a variety of nutrients to perform at their peak, and penile health is no exception. Imagine your body as a finely tuned machine. The food you consume is the fuel that drives this machine. Just like a car wouldn't run smoothly on low-quality fuel, your body can't perform at its best without the right nutrients. Now, let's talk about some of these key nutrients. First up, we've got vitamins and minerals. These are crucial for all bodily functions, including blood flow and nerve function, both of which play a significant role in penile health. Foods high in vitamin B1, for instance, help nerve signals move faster, including those that go to your penis. You can find this vitamin in eggs, peanuts, and kidney beans. Next, we have foods rich in omega-3 fatty acids like salmon, tuna, and olive oil. These healthy fats help improve blood flow, a crucial aspect of penile health. Then, there's the magic of dark chocolate. It's not just a delicious treat. Dark chocolate contains flavonoids, which are potent antioxidants that can lower blood pressure and decrease cholesterol, both of which can contribute to healthy penile function. Let's not forget about onions and garlic. These might not be the best for your breath, but they're excellent for your blood circulation. They thin the blood and prevent clotting, ensuring smooth blood flow throughout your body, including your penis. Remember, a balanced diet isn't just about what you should eat, but also about what you shouldn't. Excessive alcohol, for instance, can lead to erectile dysfunction, so moderation is key. Remember, a healthy body fosters a healthy penis. Now let's move on to the next point. Exercise is not only good for your overall health, but also for your penile health. Now let's delve into some specific exercises that have been linked to penile enlargement. Two of these are Kegels and Yelking. They might sound exotic, but don't worry. They're not as daunting as they seem. Kegels, named after Dr. Arnold Kegel, who introduced them, are exercises that strengthen the pelvic floor muscles. These muscles are crucial for sexual function. They help to improve blood flow to the penile area which can aid in achieving firmer, longer-lasting erections. To perform a Kegel, try stopping and starting your urine flow. That muscle you feel contracting, that's your pelvic floor muscle. Now, without any other muscle movement, try to contract and relax that muscle repeatedly. Congratulations, you're doing Kegels. Next up is Yelking, a technique that may date back to ancient Arabic civilization. It's a simple manual exercise that involves repeatedly stroking the penis in a squeezing motion from the base to the glands, with the aim of pushing more blood into the penile tissue. It's kind of like milking a cow, but remember, gentle is the way to go here. Overdoing it can lead to injury. Regular practice of these exercises can potentially increase both the length and girth of your penis. However, it's essential to remember that like any other form of exercise, consistency is key. You won't see overnight results, but with patience and persistence, you may notice improvements over time. Also, it's worth noting that while these exercises can contribute to penile health and potentially enlargement, they should be complemented by a healthy lifestyle. Proper diet, adequate sleep, and reduced stress levels are all critical in maintaining optimal sexual health. So, get moving and start exercising today. Now, let's move to our next natural method. Your lifestyle can significantly impact your penile health. This statement might surprise some, but it's an absolute truth. The choices we make in our daily lives can have a profound effect on our overall health, including our sexual health. Let's delve into some of the lifestyle changes that can contribute to penile enlargement. First, on the list is smoking. It's a well-known fact that smoking can cause harm to your lungs and heart, but did you know it can also affect your penile size? Smoking narrows the arteries, including those that carry blood to the penis. This can lead to a decrease in the size and firmness of your erections. So if you're a smoker and you're serious about penile enlargement, it's time to consider quitting. Next, let's talk about alcohol. 
While a glass of wine or a beer now and then isn't necessarily harmful, excessive alcohol consumption can have a negative impact on your sexual health. Alcohol can lead to erectile dysfunction and can also inhibit sexual arousal, leading to a smaller erection. Reducing your alcohol intake can help improve your penile health and potentially increase its size. Maintaining a healthy weight is another crucial factor. When you carry excess weight, especially around your belly, it can make your penis appear smaller. Losing weight can not only improve your overall health, but can also enhance the perceived size of your penis. Other lifestyle changes that can contribute to penile enlargement include getting enough sleep, staying hydrated, and managing stress levels. All these factors play a critical role in maintaining a healthy blood flow to your penis, which is vital for optimal penile health and size. Remember, lifestyle changes don't happen overnight. It takes commitment, patience, and consistency. But the results are worth the effort. Making these changes can not only lead to penile enlargement, but also improve your overall health and well-being. Small changes in your lifestyle can lead to big results. Now on to our final point. Lastly, never shy away from seeking medical advice. This phrase is often heard, but its importance cannot be overstated, especially when it comes to matters that directly affect your health and well-being. In the pursuit of improving ourselves, it's easy to get lost in the sea of information available to us. We might be tempted to take matters into our own hands, to diagnose and treat ourselves based on what we find on the internet. But remember, what works for one person might not work for another, and what appears as a simple solution might hide potential risks and complications. This is especially true when it comes to penile enlargement. Despite the array of natural methods we've discussed, it is crucial to remember that each individual's body responds differently. What appears to be a harmless diet change or exercise routine might not be suitable for everyone. Your body is unique and so should be your healthcare plan. That's why consulting with a healthcare professional is essential. Doctors are trained to understand the complexities of the human body. They can provide personalized advice and guide you through the process, ensuring it is safe and effective for you. They can help identify any underlying health issues that might be affecting your size and can recommend the best course of action based on your specific circumstances. Keep in mind that there's no quick fix when it comes to your health. It requires attention, care, and professional guidance. The dangers of self-diagnosing and self-treating are real and can lead to adverse effects on your health. The internet can be a valuable source of information, but it should never replace professional medical advice. In conclusion, while there are natural ways to increase your size, it's important to approach them with caution and under the supervision of a healthcare professional. Your health should always be your priority. Remember, your health is your wealth and there's no shame in seeking help. After all, seeking advice is not a sign of weakness, but a step towards better understanding and caring for yourself. To sum up our discussion today, let's take a moment to reflect on the natural ways we've explored for penile enlargement. It's important to remember that these methods are all about promoting overall health and wellness, and not just focused on size. First, we discuss the importance of a balanced diet. By incorporating nutrient-rich foods into your daily meals, you're not only promoting your general health, but you're also contributing to your body's ability to perform at its best. This includes maintaining a healthy blood flow, which is essential for penile health and performance. Next, we highlighted the role of regular exercise, particularly pelvic floor exercises. These exercises can help strengthen the muscles involved in sexual function, potentially improving both performance and size. We also delved into the value of lifestyle changes, such as quitting smoking and moderating alcohol consumption. These changes can help improve your overall health and, in turn, potentially enhance your sexual performance and size. Lastly, we emphasize the importance of seeking medical advice. If you're considering any changes to your diet, exercise routine, or lifestyle, it's always best to consult with a healthcare provider. They can provide personalized advice based on your unique health needs and goals. Thank you for joining us today on Dr. Nguyen's channel. Remember, it's not about the size, it's about health and confidence. Stay healthy, stay confident, and see you in the next video.